Okay, are you seeing this? Whatever. It's pretty spectacular. Wow. Those mountains, gorgeous. We converted this massive old church off of 20th Street into this like insane, just dreamland. There was dancers hanging from the rafters and glitter just like exploding from the ceilings. There was boys and girls and club kids and queens and everything in between, you name it. And so it's my first night there. Yeah. And I see this guy, it's like this like perfect Adonis, just like flowing blonde hair and sculpted abs and just like a total Greek statue. Wait, so you were in your 20s? Uh-huh. And I was terrified. He turned out to be a total prick, but your first one usually is. Actually, most of them are. <laughs> Everyone except your dad. Aaron, what's up? You guys hear that? No, what? I don't hear anything. Exactly. No traffic, no sirens, no shouting. I think it's the most beautiful sound I've ever heard. Well, you know what they say about silence, right, Dad? What? It's deafening. How original. I think she means it's peaceful. So, what about you, Dad? What? How'd you lose your virginity? Was it with mom? What? I was about 100 years old, which is how old you'll be when you lose yours. How do you know I haven't lost it already? Okay, booger, dinner's over. You're done. <laughs> no. You know it's just because of her mom, right? She's feeling abandoned. Let's just give her some time. She'll stop blaming you soon enough, and when school starts up again, she'll be busy, like, totally being a senior. Yeah. Yeah, maybe you're right. You should be like the cool new kid. Too. Yeah, exactly. She'll be fine. She'll be better than fine. She'll be too legit to quit. That's what all the cool kids are saying, right? I, I, I don't know. I'm the old man, remember? You're the New York party monster. Come on, baby. You know I burned all those brain cells years ago. Don't burn anymore. Mm -hmm. You really have to start tomorrow. Mm -hmm. You know I do. Can't afford to take another day off. Yo, rise and shine, Booger. It's your first day in paradise. Screw off. Come on, your dad's already left to work. Let's surprise him and get this palace put together. No. Come on, kid, get no. up.
I look good though, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's hilarious. Yeah. What did you use for your tits? Um, socks, obviously, stuffed with rice. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> I don't know, you think that one's good? <laughs> Check that out. Wait. <laughs> oh my god, is that my dad? <gasps> Oh, oh, she's such my. a pretty girl. No, yeah. no, she's hideous. What? Uh-uh, honey, this is not hideous. This is punk rock. <laughs> oh my god, it's my dad in a dress. It's not punk rock. Oh, booger. Believe me, choosing to live your life loud and proud is about the bravest thing you can do in this world. How's it going? This sucks, Kayla. Yeah, I know. You might as well be in another country. Don't say that. You know I don't want to be here. Hey. Learn to knock, Dad. I didn't knock. Well, you have to wait for an answer. Hey, Mr. Miller. How are you liking the small town life? Hey, Derek, how's it going? Doing my best. City's not the same without your daughter, though. Oh, well, you guys will be together soon enough. I'm sure of that. Hey, Derek. I'm gonna get murdered if I stay in this room any longer. So, um, we'll catch up later, okay, dude? Sounds good, Mr. Miller. All right. I'm going. He's fine, I guess. Just do me a favor, Kayla. I don't mean anything by this, but just don't share any drinks with them, okay? All men are created equal. They are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights. That among these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Hey, how's it coming? Slow. This guy's the worst. Honestly, I just can't believe I'm still taking on spec work. Won't be for long. I've seen enough of your writing to know how brilliant you are. Yeah, yeah. Get to work. I want some help paying off this damn house.
Hi there. Hi, I'm Tiffany, your new neighbor. Oh, oh, hi, I'm Aaron. <laughs> Sorry to come by so early. I just, I saw your gardener working, so I figured I'd come say hi. My gardener? I, I, oh, oh, no, that he's not, he's my, uh, uh, my partner. Malik, oh. come say hi. This is uh, Tiffany, our next door neighbor. Hi. Wow, that's so exciting. We, we don't have any of you in town. Really? None, huh? Maybe they're just all in hiding. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I brought over a housewarming gift. When it blooms, it's just, it's stunning. Okay, thank you. That's, that's really, uh, that's, we didn't... Oh, don't worry about it. I'm just so happy we have some fresh faces in the neighborhood. Nothing ever changes around here. <laughs> Oh, well, that sounds like just the kind of change we're looking for. <laughs> I better get going. I just, yeah, it was so good to meet you. Bye bye. She seems nice. Mm, she's something. This is, uh. Okay, well, I gotta go. What you doing, bugger? Printing resumes. I'm gonna go crazy if I'm stuck inside with you every day. So sweet of you, Kayla, thank you. Yeah, you know, I was kind of hoping you'd stick around and be my assistant. Well, yeah, what are you gonna pay me with? My dad's money. Excuse you, I have my own money, thank you. Yeah, right. Let's hope I don't end up on a milk carton. Okay, your dad and I won't miss you if you do. I did not realize we were painting. Yeah. I figured I could use a fresh coat. It looks great. What'd you get up to today? Oh my God. What did you get up to today? You know, I hung out, packed a few things, got a job. Shut up. No, for real, all by herself. What? Ooh, you're looking at the new hostess at Bill and Pete's Bar and Grill. Oh my god. Totally celebrating that. You're getting up. Why you look so blue? Boy, I know it's true. You do, you do, you do. You do. <laughs> There's room for one more. It's 
Yeah, you. Yeah, you. Leek, you're missing out. Get up here. Leek, get over here. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Do you remember when we were kids? That summer we stayed up at your aunt's cottage and you thought it was a good idea to tell your friend Erica about us. And do you remember how I said I had a really bad feeling about it? Except the world's a different place, Malik. It's not like it was back then. Oh my God, how can you say that and actually even believe yourself? Someone just broke into my house and spray painted the okay, world. don't, don't say it. I hate that word. Well, my point is the world is exactly the same place as it was back then. People don't change, Liam. They just get better at hiding how they feel. I know you don't mean that, Malik. What does Aaron think about it all? He thinks the same as me. You haven't told him yet, have you? You said a security system installed, Malik. What is he going to say about that? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, whatever. It's your life. You do what you want. I gotta go. Oh, hi. Hey. What are you doing in here? Just putting away some boxes. How was your day? So long. Mm. Can you please hurry up and get famous already so I can retire? Maybe in a million years. Confidence. That's great. I knew there was a reason I fell so hard for you. <laughs> I'm so glad you guys could make it. Well, thanks so much for inviting us. Marshall, is there our neighbors I told you about? Mm. Hi there. Hey. Hi, I'm Aaron. Aaron, welcome. It's Malik. Malik, welcome. Hi. Thank you. Hi. So, Malik, it seems that you and I have a little something in common. Oh, yeah? What's that? Well, we both stay at home all day while our significant others venture out into the real world. <laughs> <laughs> I, I run an IT company from the house. I, I, I work alone. I'm a one-man show, but I love it. Oh, yeah, I, um, I, I found this epiphany on my way out for lunch the other day. I mentioned you. a writer. A writer? That's so exciting. Mm -hmm. So what are you working on? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's just a bio piece, just like ghost writing. Well, to new neighbors. <laughs> new neighbors. New neighbors. Cheers. Cheers. What the hell are you doing on my property? Take this. 
Please take it. Take it. Take it. Don't tell anyone. What the fuck? What's going on? Is everything all right? Uh, do you know where I put my keys? I get so confused lately. I have... Uh, my sense of time is so mixed up these days. A security system. We didn't even have one in Chicago. <laughs> I said I'm sorry, okay? I should have asked. I'm sorry. How much did this thing cost? Like a few thousand. Oh, my God. Do you know what people do in the suburbs? They leave their doors unlocked. Well, it's nice to see you, too. You call the alarm company today? For what? A refund? You're not keeping that thing. So is this what you do in this town? Pretty much. So, you're the new girl with the two dads, right? Here we go again. No, I, I didn't mean it like that. I think it's pretty cool. So where's your mom? You're nosy. Just want to get to know you all. She's probably partying in Costa Rica with her new family and my inheritance. Ouch. You really want to get to know me? know this. Shit! <laughs> no way. I just crushed you. Get rematch. I'm doing this again.
say? Oh God, is he? Aaron, last night, I, I, I think I saw something over there. There was some tragic, isn't it? Yeah. Do you know what happened? Well, his grandson found him in the middle of the night. Called a few of us over to say our goodbyes. Turned into a bit of a celebration. It's just so sad for him. They were really close. Are you stalking me now? Pretty much. Where are you going? I'm heading to work. Calling sick? No way. Come on. Please? You just don't give up, do you? You ever think about leaving? I don't think so. I mean, everything's here. My friends family you I have a boyfriend back in the city I mean at least I think I still do should probably figure that out Do you see that? What is he doing? Come on, let's get out of here. What? What is that? It's just look, I just really don't want to go over there. Those people creep me out. Oh my god, you always do this. Do what? Every time we try to make friends who are a bit more like normal, you create drama. What does normal mean? You know what I mean. <laughs> okay. Um, what's the word for an Uncle Tom but for gay people? Really? 
Well, I don't care what anybody says. It doesn't matter if you're a single mother or a married couple like us or, or even, you know, love is all that matters. I mean, that's a really nice thought and everything, but I'm not sure most people would actually agree with that. Well, people who don't are assholes. Mm -hmm. Well, come on, honey, they are. No, he's right. Even my ex-wife showed her true colors. You wouldn't believe how many times I had to hear her lawyers trying to educate me on how being gay meant that I wasn't fit to parent my own daughter. Mm. <sighs> yeah, I, I believe the official term they used to describe our relationship was illegitimate. That's right. High risk? It was just one of my favorites. Well, you know what high risk means? What? Oh, Jesus. Look, I, I find it disgusting how easy it is for false stereotypes to shape public opinion. People don't think anymore. They follow. Kyler, is that you? Yeah. Sorry, I missed dinner. It's in the fridge, honey. So, where were you, son? This is dope. It's a new friend. How did it go? Very well. Thanks, Mom. I'll be in my room. Seems like a good kid. Well, he's a teenager. Does that count? <laughs> Did you say the second door or the third? All right, who's ready for Apple Crumb? Richard. He was my great great something or other. Apparently, quite a shift's mate. He fought for the blue coats. I could have sworn you said it was the third door on the right. Second, but who's counting? You can really see the family resemblance. Well, a long bloodline. I started gathering info on our lineage over a decade ago, and I've got a solid collection of photos now. Come on, let me point you in the right direction. Thank <laughs> you. 
I thought your ass got a job. It's part time. Duh. Make sure not to strain yourself too hard. I'm not stupid. Thanks. I need to talk to you. It's about my grandpa. Please. I'm sorry if he startled you. In your backyard. His mind... It wasn't well. But did he... say what he was doing out there? Honestly, your guess is as good as mine. Did he give you anything? No. Why? They're calling it a suicide, saying that he took all his medication at once. I miss him. We had company. Uh, Aaron, this is. Uh... I'm Matthew. Hi, uh, it's nice to finally meet you. You're Aaron, right? That's right. Uh, well, I should probably go. Um, thank you for listening. You obviously like him. Who? Matthew. It's been a while since we played with someone. Could be fun. Yes, there it is. <clears throat> Do you remember when you dragged me to that party at your friend Jason's? It could be like that. It's never gonna happen. We only want you. Poison or something and die. 
God, that's so much blood. offers a path back towards righteousness, away from sin and temptation. These young men and women, they're suffering inside. It became my duty. That's why I founded the Ernie Darrelson Clinic in my father's name. started smoking, I just... Well, did you back it up? Oh my god. Malik, you've been in there for almost an hour! You're using up all the hot water. You have to go. Sorry, booger, I'll be out in just a minute. to move. Oh, God. Here we go. We need to get out of this town, Aaron. There's something not right about this place. What are you talking about? The night the alarm went off, Mr. Reinhardt, he gave me a piece of paper. 
Uh, there's a series of dates on it. It goes back for decades. Will you just listen to me? He was trying to warn us. I saw them in his house. Aaron Marshall and Matthew and a bunch of them, and they were doing something in there. And then the next day, Ryan Hardy just turns up dead. I just... There was another couple, Aaron. There was a gay couple that lived in town, and they were killed 10 years ago. Why the fuck wouldn't Marshall and Tiffany have mentioned this? They knew, and they didn't say anything. They've been lying to us. Nobody's lying to us, Mal. If you engaged with them, if you literally spent any time at all being social with them, you would know this. They were close with them. They told me all of this. Marshall and Tiffany are good people, Mal. And you know what? I happen to like this town. Oh, Jesus Christ, Aaron. You need to stop thinking that, that everyone's trying to get you all the time. I thought we were past this. What happened to you was tragic, I know, Don't but... Go there, but please. It's not gonna happen again, I promise. You can't make that kind of promise. When we calm down, you're just seeing what you wanna see. The numbers are just noise, they're meaningless. Every 10 years? You don't think that's even like a little bit strange? Do you think maybe the reason you keep calling me is because you're looking for permission? Permission for what? To move on. I have moved on, okay? I've clearly moved on. <sighs> we can't keep doing this, Malik. I'm hanging out. What? No, Liam, I, come on, I need your help with this. Liam! Hello?
below. Hello? Who's there? Why was my hard drive removed? What is this? This isn't me. Aaron, I swear, this didn't happen. <laughs> Pretty real to me. Don't you see what's going on? They're doing this to us. Why didn't you tell me that this is what you wanted? I would have let you. It didn't happen. It's not, Aaron. Don't go. Stop. I don't... I don't want to see you here when I get back. Where am I supposed to go? Figure it out. Aaron! Explain it was. Wait, wait, what did she do? She deserved it. Jessica's a total bitch. Yeah, seriously, I do not want to hear it. She said I was going to give Tyler AIDS. Because, well, you know. People see your dad and I as different than them. And different scares people. People are idiots. Miss Tyler likes me I way better than- I am fucking serious. Right now, Kayla, in this town and in this country, it is not safe for people that stand out. Okay, you need to forget everything that I said about loud and proud. Do not draw attention to yourself. Don't speak out. Don't speak up. It is not safe. Besides that Tyler kid is a little creep. He only wants one thing from you anyway. I don't want you hanging out with him. Do you hear me? Kayla, do you hear me? Yeah. I hear you. Promise. Wait. 
think we're just we're done. I wanna be with you. <laughs> We should wait. What's wrong? You don't want me? No. No, I do. I really do. It's just... I want it to be special. rights, but that's not the kind of change America needs, it's not the kind of change America wants, and it's not the kind of change we can abide in a nation we still call God's country. Help you with something? I could use a drink. Cheer up. I'm sure Aaron will come around. This doesn't make any sense. So it's not true, then? I, I'm not judging. No, it isn't true. At least I don't think it is. You don't think it is. Things have just been... It's just been a bit foggy lately. So, your hard drive. It's funny, it, Aaron seemed so worried about it when I swung by the house to pick it up, but, I mean, there was nothing wrong with it. Nothing. No, nothing. I mean, there was something else, though. Malik, I... <clears throat> I saw the folder. What folder? <laughs> well, I think you know which one. <clears throat> if people were to catch wind of that stuff, I mean, it just, it wouldn't look good, especially someone in your standing. I have no clue what you're we're talking We're friends. About. Your secret is safe with me. But if I were you, I really would consider getting some help because you obviously have a problem. I made you a, a backup hard drive over there. I'll come by later and install it. It's an exciting time to be alive, Malik. So much change happening in the world, yet 
so much seems to just stay in the same. Do you know what I mean? Excuse me. documented everything that happened to her family. Well, at least they told us how they really felt. Fuck you, whoever did this. Oh. It's all the same thing. <laughs> it's part of some kind of ritual. Every ten years they make a selection. Please, That's what... please, please do not say what I think you're about to say. We're the selection. Okay, don't, don't. We've been chosen. <laughs> For what? Once the selection's been made, there's nothing anyone could do to stop it. Meds. Right, it's been disconnected or is no longer. If you feel you have reached this request. 
recording an error, please check the number and... Mom, please stop recording me. I suck. Mom, come on. You're getting really good. I, I didn't know you were going to be here. <laughs> where, where have you been? Malik, what are you doing? Whoa, 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 whoa. Malik, Malik, no, stop. Oh, <laughs> Malik, Malik, what are, you, what are you doing? I'm protecting her. From who? You! Malik, I'm putting the house up for sale. Kayla and I, we're gonna move back to the city, I'll stay with my mother. Oh my God, thank God. Oh my God. How did you have to run as far away from this town as possible? It's not the town we're running from, Malik. I know you don't understand it. But I did what I had to do. Liam knows why I had to do it. Liam? Who's Liam Malik? My ex-boyfriend, who do you think? Jesus Christ. 
Maybe if you just, maybe if you just go talk to him. Maybe if you talk to him, then he can tell you everything, and you'll know, you'll know why I did it. I can't do that, Malik. Why? Why can't you? I have to go. No. No, Aaron, please. Aaron, don't go. Just talk to him. Just talk to him, please. Aaron, just talk to him. I was just protecting her. I, I had no choice. <laughs> We're in this together. You know that, right? To get through this. Mom, seriously? The red light is blinking. That means it's recording. What? Come on, I want to go see Ty. You're too young for a boyfriend. You got broken into in, in this town? That's what we thought. My wife is she's really upset about it. Uh, well, obviously, it must have been teenagers. Well, speaking of which, our seems to be getting along just fine. Why don't you and Ty come here to play food? I'm someone who's been around for a very long time. Kayla? 
Kayla! Kayla! I don't like this any more than you. But this is how it works. And this, well, this is how we make it work. You can take me, okay? You can take me. I'll do anything you want. Just don't hurt her. You know I can't do that. It's too late. Stay the fuck away from her! Kayla, open the door! Kayla, open the door! Wake up! out of jail tonight, Malik. You had drugs in your system. Another relapse. You killed her, you killed your husband, and then yourself. Everybody is going to say, and not one soul will question it because of who you are. People won't care, Malik. They've already got their minds made up. They're afraid of you. And when the tides change, there will be someone else to be afraid of. There always is. There always will be. It's human nature, fear. We just exploit it. someone vulnerable and they vilify them. They do this so no one bats an eye. This happened to us our first night living here. Everything I know about this town and what the people here have been doing is in this document. I don't know who will find this 
or what kind of person you are. But my hope is that you might be the one to finally break this cycle. Now that I've told you all this, what you do with the information is up to you. Just remember, hope is never silent. <laughs>